Hi everyone, welcome back to another video from us. You're welcome ambassador. Today we will be checking you on different parts of Dalhousie campus. So now we will take you guys on a campus tour. We are here on Studley and behind me is the DSU building. On this part of the campus, you'll find most of the main buildings and the services offered by Dalhousie. And you'll also find a lot of on-campus residences over here. Here I am at the bus stop right in front of the Dalhousie Student Union Bureau. With the dark card, you can access the bus to downtown and other major tourists. Or if you like, you can use your bike to access other parts of downtown with bike lanes located around Halifax. Remember guys, safety first. As you guys can see, most places on campus is uh, within walking distance from each other. Over here we are at the DSU office and you can find many services here. There's a food court, there's conference rooms, printing center, the food bank, bookstore, a barber shop and the Bisset Student Center. Next, we'll take you to the Kenneth Zero Management Building. Hey, so hey guys, right here we have the Kenneth Zero Management Building, and right next to it is the Goldberg Science Building. Next to the Stadley, we'll have the Carlton Campus. You can find the dental and health buildings there. On this side, you will find most of the major hospitals in Halifax too. Over here, we have the Black Student Advising Center and the Indigenous Student Center. African descent and Indigenous students can come here for further support and services. Hey, so this is the Art Center. On my left is the Schulich School of Law. And towards my right is the McCain Arts and Social Sciences Building. Right, the Art Center is home to many important Halifax art events, such as ballets, art shows, and concerts. My favorite is the Nova Scotia's famous Nutcracker Ballet during the Christmas season. Here I am at the Killam Memorial Library. Here you would find classrooms, floors of books, and an amazing food court. You could also find computer labs, specialized library services, the writing center, and accessibility supports are also available here. There's also the grad pad where graduate students can study and meet. There's also an underground tunnel you can use to get to various parts of buildings on this side of campus, especially during the winter when it's cold. Now we'll take you guys to the Studley Court. Here we are on this side of campus. Over here, you'll, fi you'll find the McDonald Memorial Building. There's also the Sir James Dunn Building, the University Club, 
and on this side of campus you'll also find King's College. Behind me there is the Henry Hicks Administration Building. This is where students come to pay tuition, do admissions, registration or any kind of administrative transactions. Behind the Henry Hicks you're going to find the Life Sciences, Earth Sciences and Ocean Sciences buildings. Here we are at the Darflex building for all you gym lovers. It is free for students with your trusty dark art, like mine right here. There are many important activities held here during the school semester, and it has one of the largest and most modern gyms in Halifax. With various courts, a physiotherapy clinic, and an indoor track, and a huge swimming pool, Dialplex is a place to be. Here I am at the Amira Idea Building of the Sexton Campus. It is located right by Spring Garden Road and the Halifax Central Library. Here is where engineering students from the third semester come and complete their studies. And here we are, right in front of the Richard Murray Design Building. As soon as you walk in, you'll find the Irving Oil Auditorium where you have the most awesome classes. Right above it, you'll have a lot of space to hang out with friends and to study. And this is the most awesome place you can find for engineering students on campus. Thanks for watching and be sure to catch us in the next video.